What's up YouTube, it's uh, Max Merck here and I'm gonna be showing a quick little video here on uh, how to remove the center Mercedes star. So I'm gonna show you guys right now. Um, it's this one right here that I'm talking about, this center Mercedes star. I'm gonna show you guys how to remove this um, for whatever reason you have. Maybe it's to install the illuminated star on your own as a DIY or if you wanna start plastic dipping stuff, I mean, it's a whole process to remove this part of the grill, uh, depending on the model of car you have. I mean, that's there's so many different procedures, but for this main part, the star on most Mercedes vehicles, it's as simple as this. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I did that again, because uh, I know that was quick. So literally, all you have to do is go up to the star put your fingers in get a nice grip of it and turn it um counterclockwise as hard as you can and it's going to on it's going to click and it's going to unlock and you can pull it straight out and then from there on out you can uh this part comes out and you can do whatever you want you could maybe plasti dip this paint it whatever you want to do with this I don't know, hanging up on your wall. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But uh, that's this part right here that would go right there. Looks kind of weird actually without the uh, without the backing. So I'm getting off topic. So uh, that's how you remove it, and you can do whatever you want to do. You can um, maybe install the um, the illuminated star, whatever you want to do, whatever your purpose is. And from back here, you can access inside the engine bay. So if you want to wire your stuff for the illuminated star or whatever else you want to do, you can do that by putting it through here. And or you can also run it through the actual grill itself. And to reinstall it, basically, just uh, pop this part with these two prongs back in here. Make sure it's nice and secure. Push it in. Then you're going to want to make sure you're going to look where these two prongs pop out on the back. And make sure those are on, make sure those are on the bottom, and make sure the letters are upright the way they should be. And then from there, you're gonna want to put it in straight, and kind of twist it to the left to get it into the slot. Yeah. One more time, just put it in a little bit off centered to the left, just like so, off centered. Hold up, just like that, and then twist it clockwise until it pops back into place and make sure it's all secure so it doesn't uh, fall off and that's about it um, in my opinion I don't know why Mercedes made it this easy I mean anybody can just walk up to your car if they know how to do it and just pop this right off which is kind of bad I mean it is plastic but still someone's stealing a Mercedes emblem that's not good and it just pops in just like that just like so and one thing is, if you do get it wrong, if you, let's say, put it in this way, with the two prongs not on the bottom and the letters facing upright the way they should, if you put it another way, like I'm about to do right now, it's either not going to fit, and if it does fit, there's one of these sides that fits. Let me just get that right here. If you do it this way, Basically, if you can manage to get it in, just like I did right there, I managed to get it in um, without the two prongs facing downwards. And when you do that, it becomes off-centered. So it's not perfectly straight. So just to avoid this, and it gets really rough and weird. It's not the way it's supposed to go. To avoid this, just make sure you have the two prongs facing down and the letters right here facing the way they should. And just pop it in just like that. One thing you should note while doing this is that this method won't work at all for cars with Distronic Plus, or not Distronic Plus, any kind of Distronic with a sensor here. And the way you know that is if these parts are not hollow, they're filled in, and you have a flat star right here. And with that, then you obviously can't grab it and twist it. It's a completely separate method. So if you guys like this video, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching.